Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I am Melinda Michaels. Today I have a mini haul to share with you. What I got in the mail a couple weeks back. Uh, okay, without further ado, let's get into this, shall we? So, I got some lovely mail from my friend who sells Arbonne. Uh, yeah, there's two of them. There's RE9 Advanced Anti-Aging Skincare Line, which is their number one skincare line, which I kind of like. And this Prep 9, the RE Advanced Prep Work, which I believe is pretty cool. Yeah. Pink, yeah, Cleansing Polish Dew Cream. And soft fail focus, which is a sunscreen. Which I like these products. <sighs> How I found out about the lady, she's one of my friends on Facebook. I think one of my friends invited me to a party she was hosting or something among those lines. Uh, what else did I get? I recently got in the I got in the mail the Sephora favorites kit called Hello. They have a they redid their the latest kit. I think is like I forget ten dollars. This is ten dollars. This is from a couple months back. I think the coupons are still good. I'm not showing you the back of it though. So. Without further ado, let's get into this, I think. I don't even see no, like, oh, it's only good till this time of year. Yeah, so there's Tarte Arts Camera Action La Mascara. It's their firm one. Smashbox Photo Finish Vitamin Glow. Pharmacy Daily Greens Oil Free Gel Moisturizer with more Ringa and Papaya Super Gloop Goop Sunscreen SPF 40 Moroccan Oil It's their treatment and Valentino Donna Born in Roma Well, there's a couple things I've tried in here. I'm gonna Mention to you the the little like try me sizes things that I picked out to try. I got Beauty Blender Bounce. I like their foundation that I previously had. I feel like 210 if I can find it. It may work for me. Today I have on L'Oreal. Uh, I forget the L'Oreal one. You've probably seen it advertised all over the place. On, I will grab it. Or at least a sample I have. I'm back. I have Infallible 24 up to 24 hour fresh wear in the shade 415. It is... I believe this is... That doesn't say... Oh, it says rose, uh, rose Ivory. I feel like this matches me perfectly. I use it with a beauty blender, but I think next time I'm trying it with a brush. I have a foundation brush. It's from Wet n Wild. It's from their pink holographic or hollow. I call it hollow line. It's, uh, yeah, you've seen it. You've probably seen people posting about it like what? I forget last year's brush shiz didn't do weren't my cup of tea but the that for 50 I got a whole set for 15 bucks and that was one of the brushes well I have two I found one on clearance for a dollar so yeah that's the foundation I've been wearing or today I wore specifically I feel like Shade-wise, 210 
will work for me, but the others I'll pass. I'll either keep the dark shade for a, con a liquid contour and give my mom the middle two. Because I feel like, what, 140, 150, 160 would work. I feel like those four. Yeah, I feel like 210 would work for me. But thank God I have a mixing foundation that I use to make the shades a little more me. And then I think this is, this is a foundation. Yay, another foundation from Wonder Beauty. Never in my life have I tried anything from them. I have never tried anything from them. Here, I'll hold on this side. <sighs> yeah, like there's light, light medium, medium, and tan. I feel like the light and the light medium will work for me, personally. I like that it has like a sponge... Doe foot applicator. So, yeah. Yeah. Like, light, light, medium will work for me. I wish fair light. That would also work. Because I'm paler than vampire. <laughs> a vampire. I have a lot of bronzer and stuff on. So, let's get into this. Okay. So, yeah. I grabbed three things out of here. The Donna Valentino Donna Born in Roma. I tried this before. It's it's a pretty perfume. It is a uh, Macy's box. Like they give you like if you see it on your newsfeed for I think Facebook or Instagram or and Instagram. If you see it on one of those, you'll get like four different ones. Like usually two female and two men's usually but like I got this in one of my previous boxes but I got this in here too I kind of like it it's not really my something I gravitate towards then the next thing I grabbed pharmacy daily greens oil free moisturizer never tried this before Never tried it before, but I've heard good things. Thank God for looking at um, baggings and stuff like that on right here on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, I love the jar. I do. I really love the jar. It's cute. It's cute and tiny. <laughs> I would so use this. I would so use this. I I opened it the day I got it. Just the smell. This reminds me kind of eucalyptus -y. It does. It really does. I wonder if it says anything about it. Papaya and Moringa. I don't see nothing here about it. If it has it in. But... It smells like eucalyptus kind of smell to me, what it reminds me of, but I like it a lot. Definitely recommend that. I'm going to save the mascara for last, which I have another unboxing coming right here. So, okay. So, I'm saving the, what? The two, the remaining two, or the remaining things, uh, Super Goop, Unseen Sunscreen. Everybody needs one of these. It just is, like, a deluxe size sample that you'd get with, like, a purchase of whatever, 25, I think. 25 or so, 35, I don't know. That's what you get. I'm putting everything back in the bag when I'm done. Make it easier on me. Please, make it a little easier. This, I freaking, this is one, the next two are two reasons why I wanted this bag. Two reasons. Uh, it's the Smashbox Vitamin Glow. I love this. I absolutely freaking love 
this. I love this a lot. I got, I picked this out. I picked the little foil packet out in a previous order from Sephora. Um, how did I get this? I want to mention. I do crowd tap. I save up my points for things randomly. And like if I see something like, oh, 20, 10, 15 bucks or if it's on sale, I put in my cart. I I go for I go on the website uh, to select said gift card and it comes in my email like two days, two to five days later, I would say two to five days, somewhere between there. Um, yeah, that's how I get my gift cards or where I get my gift card cards from. I've tried other sites and they're like, nope. <laughs> so, okay. Another thing I cannot live without Moroccan oil. This is my hair savior. <laughs> this. I, I got my other same size bottle in a pinch me box that I'm like, I freaking love it. <laughs> I've used it in the past. I was like, mm, I don't know if it does anything for my hair or whatnot, but I thought I'd give it a second chance, another chance to try it again, and it saved my life. I use it when my hair was mangled. I recently cut it. <laughs> I cut it couple months back, I cut it like down to about here, here, somewhere, let me, what, in this region, I cut it. My hair was like down to my waist, down to my waist, curly, kinky, and all that. My hair was a mess. <laughs> I have, we have a dot. Uh, right now, I live with my parents, but I get free roam of the house whenever I feel up to it. And so we have a dog. His name is Munchkin. He has mangled, like, tangly hair, cotton ball hair, kind of. And so, yeah, his hair, me and him have the kind of same condition. It's, like, mangled. Like, uh... I think it was the, yeah, it was this side. I have, like, a chunk. I mean, a chunk. Like, that, I would say, that size of a chunk of a tangled mess. I clipped, I cut that out of my own hair a couple months back. Because my hair was long and tangled. And I couldn't take the long hair anymore. I grew it out. I was in a rock band, and so, yeah, that's why I wanted the Amy Lee hair style, you know, the long hair, all that good stuff, but I decided to cut my hair because it was mangled, and now it's more manageable, and my hair is awesome. I have it in a low pony today because I was feeling that vibe. <laughs> today yeah like it comes I would say oh there's some long pieces that I have to get like trimmed up trimmed up a little bit but it comes down to like about I would say about right about my boobs area like there so let's get back into this okay so the lights camera lashes mascara I've tried this in Sephora before I did. I haven't worn it since, but I like the brush. I don't want to drop that. I'm putting the... It's like fluffy and stuff. I love that. It's one of my faves. I'm like, I like it. It's cool. Something I would buy with the 15% off that coupon. That, the Smashbox, and the Moroccan oil is what I would use <laughs> mainly because that is awesome you know plus I love that Sephora gives you the option like you don't have to really spend like oh spend a hundred and twenty dollars or spend this 
uh, buy this, whatever, and get this for free. Online, they let you choose what you want to try. In store, it's a whole nother story. I hate going in store. I actually do. I don't know who even works in that Sephora anymore or what. Ulta has my heart. <laughs> has my heart. They have my freaking heart. They do. Because they have drugstore. They have high end. They have hair products. They have in-house co collection. They have an awesome clearance area. What? That's why I love it. Love. 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 Ulta. It's like, I, I only go to Sephora for the, my birthday gift. Earlier this, what, four months? <laughs> yeah, the fourth month of this year. Because of COVID, we couldn't go in store and get it. So I'm like, you know what? I'll place an order. I had, I saved up enough points, I think, for two gift cards of $20. So I, like, placed two separate orders. There's, I think there's a video of me talking about the, what I got on my channel. I may link it at the end. Maybe I'll try to link it in the eye above somewhere here. So, yeah, that was my haul. Well, part one. Part two is coming right after this. It's another video. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you learned something. Give it a thumbs up. Smash the thumbs up button if you love these videos. It helps me out to know what people really like to watch versus what I'd rather show you. You know, if you're new here. Subscribe, smash the notification bell. It'll let you know whenever I upload, which is random in my terms. In my terms, it's pretty random. You know, I hope you enjoyed it. Smash the thumbs up. Subscribe to my awesome channel. I hope you really like how I'm filming now. I recently upgraded from a crappy tablet to a laptop that works this way if in case I could see somebody coming in my doorway now versus using the tablet which was like yay big probably this size a little way smaller than this you know I hope you enjoyed I'll see you in my next video bye